Hi, my name is Tanja and I'm with Calcasieu Parish Public Library. Today we're going to do DIY bookmarks. Here are your supplies. Not all of the supplies will you need depending on what bookmarks you choose. These are just some examples. Um, basic ribbon, paper clip, and scissors. That's the first supplies you'll need for this first event. You're going to take and measure your ribbon 6 inches and 12 inches. Just remember that black mark, you're going to cut it off, so measure behind the 6 inch and the 12 inch. You're going to feed your ribbon through the paper clip, the side that is one single hook. Once you feed it through, that's the back of your paper clip. So that's going to be your front. Once you pull it through completely, that's your bookmark. You're going to have various lengths and sizes. Just remember, you can do 6, 12, whatever you choose to do. But that was the first style of bookmark. Here's your supply list again. Now we're going to do bookmarks that have color, more various styles and sizes. This is um, paint splashes that I chose from different department stores. Different department stores have various lengths and sizes. So this right here, we're going to do the actual string. Remember when you do string, you're going to tie it twice. Ribbon, you're going to do once because you don't want to tie it too, too tight to break your, your hole punch. On this one, I chose to do two colors, so I glued two paint samples together and did a hole punch in it to put my ribbon through. Remember, ribbon, one not and then once you pull it through you're going to have different styles and types of bookmarks just remember you can have fun with it you can do stamps you can take and do different uh, stamps on your bookmarks um, when you do your hole punches in your paint samples just remember you can do it to the left or to the right whatever you choose or even in the middle if you don't want to do stamps on your bookmarks, you can write on your bookmark. You can do what page you stopped on if you want to make notes and different things. And the string, the white string, if you want to mark a page, you can use one of those strings to go back and mark a page. But these are different styles and types. There is your permanent marker where you can write on it, or you can use an ink pen. It doesn't matter. Different styles, different types, bookmarks. Have fun with it and just know that we want you to visit us at the library and read our, do our summer reading program and visit with us. Sign up for a reading program this year, Oceans of Possibilities. Just remember, visit us at Epps Memorial Library or at any branch that is near you. Thank you for visiting, and here's your supply list again, DIY bookmarks. Thank you, guys.